Brian Clay in my California, be and we're. My blog will be better. Oh, you haven't blog, made one in your like blog six will be posted oh. next summer yeah, for this have trip. A full time job and trying to do so all this shit. Okay. Anyway, I support Morgan's vlogging, and you should go follow her on everything because she's funnier than me and faster than me and smarter than me so yeah but anyway we're going to brian clay okay can you just both of us all right we are going we're going now to the airport to denver okay we made it to colorado springs and we're going to dinner i'm gonna have witch witch gracie's on her way to chipotle and <laughs> And what are you gonna have? I'm also having witch witch. Oh yeah, and Aaron's having witch witch. So. Good morning. Here's Good morning. Where... Good morning. <laughs> Here's where the trash. Tra oh, I touched your butt. Here's where the trash <laughs> was getting taken. And I slept like booty. With Morgan, we slept together. Morgan's engaged. Engaged! So I. Uh, We're getting married! Yeah. We slept in a together. barn, hopefully. Alright, we threw TSA and they, I got tagged for a random shoe check and he had to wipe my shoes down. She's a drug mule. No. <laughs> Don't say that. That could be bad. Okay, we're getting on the plane now in a second. Do you want to talk for like two seconds? Sure. Okay. <laughs> Are you excited to get on the plane? Always. <laughs> because they knew your bag was really big. Here we go, down the tunnel. Bro, these always make me feel like I'm skydiving. Like, just falling. Ah! We're on our second flight, and I kind of think that maybe I'm gonna have my whole entire row to myself, which will be really sick, so. We landed in California, and it's green outside, and we got our bags. And Mitchell freaking was gonna let my bag go round and round the carousel while I was in the bathroom. Freaking. <laughs> We're here at the hotel, the classic hotel we always stay at. Wow. Ooh. We're in our hotel room. Don't touch me. <laughs> All right, we're doing, well, I'm not doing my pre meet, but Erin is. She's trying to see people tomorrow. Yay. And we're at Mount Sac to do our runny run. 40 minutes so oh my gosh my freaking baby hairs are falling from my eyes okay bye this is so beautiful wow oh my gosh oh. here's the steeple people steeple people mitchell show them your new upgrade upgrade and now we're having chipotle after our 35 minutes good morning we are at starbucks now getting the essentials. Uh, I think we're gonna go target on this. Fun fact, I fell in the bushes outside of Starbucks last year, the day after my 10K, and I cried because I sucked air because I fell in the bushes. All right, I'm going to pre-meet. There's other people going too, but my roommates, Gracie and Morgan, are racing today, so they don't have a pre-meet, but look at the pool. Oh, wow. Too bad we can't swim because it's we race and swimming makes me tired. Here we are at Mountain Sack. Wow, I've never actually seen the stadium, but it's kind of cool. But they got too fancy schmancy and now they don't want everybody racing here. So we need their meet. Pre meet done. We're in the parking lot stretching and it's freaking hot, but well. Alrighty, we did a little Target run to get out and stretch the legs. I got some shampoo, conditioner, because our hotel doesn't have any coffee filters. I got some new earrings, because um, my other ones were making my ears bleed. And then I got a little kombucha thing and a sh tank top, um, a noon. And then I got my roommate friend Morgan some nail files, because she needed them. And some purple nail polish there for Morgan. So, yeah, it's my haul. Now we're waiting for the Uber back to the hotel because we just skid out a lot over here. So we're at the track, we're gonna get dinner, and then these gals are gonna steeple. I'm going to steeple. <laughs> so yeah. And we're gonna watch them and eat our dinner and then go to bed. Good night. Glad to us. Oh, we could have gone around that way. There we go. Let's go. 
back from the track meet um my roommates are not but my teammate broke the division two record tonight in the steeplechase and qualified for the olympic trials and is like five seconds off of the olympic standard so gracie hi to everybody yay slay um my other teammates all did so good i'm so proud of them and i race tomorrow at late at night so i still have a while but all right, it's race day finally. I'm running 5K tonight with E-Run at Laverne because we entered too late to be in the Brian Clay 5K. Yeah, we'll at, but 5K or 1500, Brian Clay tomorrow. And then here I have my hot oat milk latte. And I got a banana bread loaf. So yeah, and we had to come to the Starbucks and the Target because that's the only coffee that was fast and near us. So. We just went to Target to get some beauty supplies to make ourselves look pretty um, because we decided that we both looked a little bit gross. Um, but we, what we lack in looks, we make up for in being funny. We're hilarious. <laughs> Dr. Abby has nothing on this. <laughs> yeah, so now we're going to Juice and Bowls. Right next to Sushi Me Rollin'. <laughs> sushi Me Rollin'. And that ice cream place. Remember, that ice cream place across the track is so good. I'm gonna have that tomorrow. Anyway. I just okay, bye. I'm <laughs> Are you gonna mom it? Bro, ever since I drank or. Alrighty. Morgan's eating her lunch. And I'm going for a shakeout because I race in six hours. Bye. Bye. I'm gonna do one mile and it's looking a little bit cold outside, so. Okay, we're on our way to the track. Here's the view. Here's the squad. All right, we're at the track now and we went to the bathroom and it's in this really strange building. It's like a two-story tent, but it's like a maze. And we had to follow like a bajillion signs to find the bathroom, but um, yeah, it's warm in here and it's cold outside, so. All righty, we're watching the women's steeple. We just checked in, I'm number 11 and my roommate is in this race for Trinidad. There she is right there. In the back, go Megan. And my teammate's sister for UCLA. So, slay. All right, we raced. It wasn't really what we wanted, but oh well. Um, it was a nice night. And my freaking ponytail kept coming out. Um, I ran 12 seconds off my PR. Tragic. But it was my first outdoor 5K in like two or two and a half years. And the outdoor 5K is so much more fun than the indoor 5K. 12 and a half laps is way better than 25 laps. So, just saying. Um, anyway, at least I qualified for conference. LOL. And yeah, 1500 tomorrow. Which I'm really excited for because I do like the 1500 more. But I had a lot of fun tonight, even though I didn't run very well. So, gotta take the small wins. I am also just like... Farting. Good morning. It's not really morning. It's actually 1 p.m. Um, but nothing has really happened today. I slept until 8 and then we went and got coffee and then we had a team meeting and then just now I ate a pita wrap with avocado hummus, lettuce, that sort of thing. Um, drank another coffee because I'm really tired. Bought a Red Bull for my race tonight. And yeah, I'm running the 1500 at like 9 p.m. Um, so I have eight more hours until race time. And probably gonna do a shakeout and maybe eat something else and then get ready to race. So, yay. Last day in California. Bro, our freaking window literally just doesn't lock. Like, look, there's no... There's no lock. This thing looks like it would be lock, but it doesn't. And then you just open it. And then over here, there's a joint rolled up in the window. So, really cute. I'm really glad someone left us that gift. Um, how sweet of them. JK, it looks like it's been there for like years and years. But yeah, anyway. Um, it's, it's awkward, a lady just walked by. But yeah, I'm gonna drink some water and sit on my phone and. That's it.
already hey vlog I just took a nap and now I'm gonna go shake out even though it got like really windy and it's supposed to rain but I'm gonna do like a mile shake out and I'm really sore from the 5k even though I ran like booty cheeks um but well I didn't run that bad but it just like really wasn't what I wanted but it also reassured me that I don't suck because in indoor I just ran a bunch of like really shit 5k's and then last night was like you know, instead of being like a minute from my PR, I was only 11 seconds from my- Yeah! <laughs> so, anyway, that was Fiona. And yeah, so hopefully in the 1500, I prefer the 1500, but I also had a lot of fun in the 5 last night, so shakeout time. All right, finished my shakeout run. I felt like ass cheeks and I couldn't run very fast, but that's why I shook out, so that I don't feel like that in the warm up. And now I'm sitting in the fancy schmancy boots. So hopefully that fixes all my problems. And here's Mitchell in our super dirty room. Look at all our trash. They don't take the trash out for us here or make our beds or bring us extra towels or, or lock the window. They don't even have the windows unlocked. So yay, here they are. So this is how we get in the room. Hey guys. Welcome back. <laughs> Hello. Okay. Alright vlog. I'm doing my makeup and getting ready. And I'm like so torn because this hairstyle, the Fiona O'Keefe inspired two braids. I think I did it better today. I did it yesterday um, for my race. And then I had to take it out in the warm up because it was whipping me in the eye. Look, see how it's like whip? And it was like literally hurting the tops of my ears because it was like hitting them. Um, but I did a little test running back and forth and I did it like a little bit higher up today. Um, and then I'll see how it feels in the warm up because if I don't like it, I'm just gonna wrap them around, turn it into a bun. Because yesterday I took them out to the ponytail and literally in my 5K race, I had to tighten my ponytail like twice because it was going to fall out. Um, anyway, here's the makeup setup. It's all the girls stuff so yeah anyway slay i got this new i think i did a haul and i wow i hadn't gotten new makeup the makeup i was using was from like seventh grade and this is just contour palette i have something in my mouth so okay Alrighty, I'm eating a little snack and I'm going to Mitchell's room to elevate my legs because I want to. And it's freaking raining so dang much. You can't tell, but it's raining a lot. Um, it's like pouring off the roof down there. So, um, hopefully it stops raining for the race. Bro, it is pouring down and people are at the track. It has to be delayed right now. It has to be delayed. It has to be delayed. Crazy. But um, hopefully it stops. It says it's gonna stop, but it's not stop. It doesn't look like it's about to stop. Um, so it'll be fun to get there. And we don't have a tent because we're D2. Um, and we're just gonna have to sit in the porta potty, I guess. Stay dry. <laughs> Anyway, that's actually crazy. It's still going. Still going ham. Out here in the Van Lee. The Van Lee. All right, it's pouring rain and they have a little gift shop in the hotel. So I bought this and it, it's an umbrella, but it has freaking Twilight. I think it's the vampire Edward on it. So, all right, it's a cold and rainy outside. So we found this storage container and we're sitting in the storage container. Turns out I probably won't even need my twilight eclipse edward umbrella oh frick which is depressing because i true now i do get to have it for the rest of my life i think i can put it in my checked bag anyway ah, it looks funny like that okay okay we're in the what is this in shipping container <laughs> it's giving like middle school vibes or homeless encampment but it's I got freezing. <laughs> it's so cold. My hands are freezing. But I got In and Out and uh, and this milkshake and this burger and it's freezing. So here's our storage unit. 
storage unit. I sucked ass. We're in the van waiting for everybody to get in and out because we are waiting for the slow pokes. So. And here's the thing. <laughs> They should have just walked their asses over here. I know. Like, I know. Or, or we could have freaking came over here in the van instead of walking in the cold. But you said walking is good for you. Walking is good for you. And you know what? Those fools have been sitting at the track. <laughs> it's 5.35 in the morning. And I think I got four hours of sleep. Um, and now we're going to the airport. Is this good stuff? Yeah. I don't know. So... <laughs> Dear Elena, happy birthday to you. All right, we're getting on the plane. It was kind of hectic to get on here, but we did it. Um, and now I'll see you back in Colorado. We landed in Colorado Springs. Oh my God, I forget, guys. Can you do Gracie's bag? And we are got our bags. And then now we're going to meet the coaches in the vans. Um, but we made it safe and sound. So now we get to do our four and a half hour drive back to Alamosa. <laughs> That's what price you pay for living in a small ass booty shite town. Hey vlog, we're in Colorado Springs. And my stomach hurts so bad. Freaking, we just went to Tokyo Joe's and we hadn't eaten all day. So we went to the airport at 5.30 and we got there so late so we didn't have time to get food in the airport. So I need to wait all the way until now. It's 1.30 p.m. And then I ate Tokyo Joe's and I got this. And now my stomach hurts so bad. Like, I'm just trying to squeeze out a fart in this parking lot. If I'm being so for real. And it's not coming out. Three pretty friends. So it's going to be a great three, three more hours until we're back in Alamosa. So, uh... I always hate this drive too. This drive is always just so brutal. Anyway. Last pit stop here at the Circle K in Walsenburg. No, we're not in Walsenburg. Oh my God, we're not. We still have to go over that hill over there. We're in New Mexico. We we're in New Mexico. Anyway. Um, we still have like two more hours. No fucking way. And everybody just went and took a big fat shit in the Circle K bathroom. I'm halfway through about all those. I love Open it up in, in there. Anyway. Have you ever seen the summer? Wow. Look at the view. Whoa. Hey vlog, we got back to Alamosa and Morgan was absolutely burping in the van and it smelled like actual like, oh, have her permission. That's her story. It smelled like garbage and poop mixed together. <laughs> it was awful. And then Precious had to keep getting out the perfume to spray so that it didn't smell like in the van but anyway now i'm loading this up with this vacuum that i need to take out for the back so bye what a what a weekend